Welcome back to the Bannerlord Soldier series, a series where we play as Darius, an ultra-nationalist soldier in the ranks of the Northern Empire. We are not a king, we are not a lord, we are just another cog in the machine which is Calradian War. Our objective? To slay as many of our enemies for the glory of the Empire and rise through the ranks of the army becoming the ultimate soldier. Hello and welcome back everyone to Darius's journey as a soldier. Thank you so much for all the love and support on the last episode. Keep crushing it with the likes and comments and I'll keep delivering these episodes. Every like and comment helps immensely to make these videos reach new people. So yeah, thanks again for your support. We're picking up from we, where we left off last time. Uh, we had a siege in Makeb. We uh, killed a lot of people. We did uh, rank up to an Imperial Infantryman. We used to be a recruit, but now they, they decided that I'm good enough to have a shield. And uh, I think I'm one kill away from becoming an Imperial Trained Infantryman. Oh, that's when we get the javelins. That's when we're going to become an actual soldier with the helmet and everything. Really, really, really appreciate the support over the last uh, video. I was actually going to make a Kenshi video that I wanted to make for a while now, but because I saw that how much you guys loved the first episode, I was like, you know what? The Kenshi video will have to wait until I make an episode two. So yeah, we're an Imperial Infantryman under Emperor Lucon. My wage is 31 dinars right now. Killed 13 people, fame is 10, loyalty to uh, the Emperor's uh, dynasty is 25, and my popularity among my fellow soldiers is 16.9. I was badly wounded in the last uh, battle in the siege, and uh, we're slowly gonna recover. I've decided actually not to ever pay for extra bandages so that we actually like simulate having to wait and heal up uh, while we march. So a few things I want to talk about. Uh, people did point out uh, that there is an updated version of the mod called Serve as a Soldier, but uh, unfortunately I'm not gonna play on that because I do have a mod list designed around this playthrough. Uh, Freelancer is not the mod that, the only mod that I'm using. I forgot to link the mod list in the first episode. It's definitely in the description of this episode. The, the, there's a link in the description of this episode for sure. So check it out if you want the mod list. But yeah, I have a bunch of other mods that uh, will uh, kick in once we actually like for example, if the story takes us to... Oh, shit! Sheesh! Darius looking good! If we do end up becoming a vassal or something like that, once Darius grows up, gets a bunch of fame, we actually... Uh, there are other mods that I could use. For example, there is a mod that makes uh, troops that uh, distinguish themselves. For example, get a, a ridiculous amount of kills in one battle. It turns them into an, uh, a companion. One of the coolest mods I've ever seen, by the way. About permadeath, a lot of people said that I shouldn't play with permadeath because they enjoy the series and don't want it to end. So I've decided, yeah, uh, the, only, um, the only handicap that I'm going to have is to not pay for, for extra bandages and medicine. And yeah, I am playing on max difficulty in all settings, so uh, that's gonna be that's gonna be that. There's actually a tournament in Diathma, and I can I can ask for temporary leave to, to engage in this tournament. I don't think yeah, two days of absence, yeah, should be fine. And then we're gonna go to the arena and we're going to join the tournament tournament. And as a soldier, of course I'm a betting man, so I'll bet on myself. All right, young Darius is in the tournament right now and we're playing for an auxiliary armor. Actually, I think that's what I have on me right now as a, as a soldier. Actually, it might not be that. Well, who cares? We're gonna win it and sell it probably. So let's uh, make our Emperor. Oh, Emperor Lucan is in the tournament as well. He's in my team. Okay, okay, guys, we need, we need to make him, uh, to make him proud of us. All right, let's try here. And they give me archery, which I'm really bad at. Alright, let's get this guy's horse. Oh my god, dude, Darius is so bad. I think I killed a guy. Holy shit, okay, oh man. Woo! Alright, alright. There's a chance, there's a chance. Oof! 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 Oh my god, the plays, Darius! Let's 
go. Let's go, baby. Let's go. What the fuck? Am I going to win this? Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Please. Ooh. Okay. Dude. If I actually clutch this, holy fuck. Oh my god, no, 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 no. Okay, okay. Come on, Darius, Darius, you can get you can do this. No! Fuck! Oh my god, no, young Darius. That was so close. That was a really valiant effort from Darius, but <laughs> kids still got a lot to learn. He still has a lot to learn. So yeah, after a warm meal at the tavern, we're gonna continue our journey. Darius is also slowly realizing that we're not going to be fighting the Kuzate forever. At some point, he is going to have to uh, fight, for example, the Southern Empire, the Western Empire. So he's really like contemplating his reasons for what he's doing. It's not just petty revenge. He genuinely believes in Emperor Lucan and uh, uh, what he promises to do for these lands if he actually ends up being the emperor. And you know what? It might just be something that Darius is willing to give his life for. Something that Darius is willing to kill and to bleed for. Oh, there's a siege here? Alright, let's go defend. Let's go defend. Ooh, they do have the, they do have the numbers. Oh, oh, clutch! Get out, help them! Come on! Let's go! Ooh! Here we go, boys. We do have the numbers advantage, but again, this is the Kuzate we're talking about. An open field. Ugh. I don't know about that. Dude, isn't this the most Chad thing ever? They're, they're doing their best. They're circling around us and shit, and we just march on as a shield wall. Oh, fuck. That, that man came out of nowhere, dude. That guy came out of nowhere. Alright, stick with the infantry, stick with the infantry. Oh shit. Holy fuck, holy fuck. Alright, here they are, here they are. Boom! Oh fuck! I got flanked. Boom! That's another kill right there. Shit. I'm low on HP though, I'm low on HP. Holy fuck. I don't think we have a lot of a high tier infantry troops. Dude, their horses are just mowing us down. Give me that shield. Alright, we're retreating I guess. No, we're not. Make up your mind, guys! Give me this. Right, a lance is at least gonna boom help us uh, hit from from uh, you know a distance because I I do be low on HP. Ooh, boom! Oh shit, 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 shit! We ran out of uh, infantry. Go back, go back, go back until we get reinforcements. Come on, come on, come on! Ooh, nice. Oh fuck. Oh! What the fuck? Out of nowhere, man. <laughs> Out of fucking nowhere. How's it looking for us? Oh man, we're we're losing people. I did get four people down though. That's that's pretty good. Ooh! He just Got him down. Holy fuck. They, they have so many cavalry, man. So much cavalry. And they still have the that ring formation still intact. God damn, we're just running into a slaughter. And the, the sergeant is just charging everyone. Shit. Yeah, they're destroying us. They're destroying. Not too much cavalry is still alive on their side. I think they're fucked. Yeah. Once you take their cavalry out and their mounted archers out, that's it for them. Yeah, that's their biggest strength. It's gone. I think we got them now. Ooh, shit. Yeah, we're destroying them. We're destroying them at this point. Even though the cavalry just keeps running into that meat shield and dying. Fucking hell. And they're running away. Let's go. Good job, Empire boys. Good job. I don't think we have met properly, my friend. You just saved my life out there and I still don't know your name. Oh, I saved your life? I didn't notice. I was just swinging. 
I was just swinging for my life. If I saved your life uh, out there, you're so very welcome, though. Well met indeed, Darius. My name is Belly Thor, and I am forever in your debt. If there's ever anything I can help you with, just let me know. What a nice man this Belly Thor guy is. Hey! Your bravery and talent noticed by your sergeant. He, our sergeant noticed that we actually stayed in formation this time. And uh, we've been uh, promoted to an Imperial trained infantryman. We now have actual fucking armor and a, and a shield and we got javelins and stuff like that. That's beautiful. Again, I'm not going to take any bandages or any healing because we need to simulate. Yeah, I, I got fucking destroyed in that battle and I need to uh, yeah live with it. What I am going to do though is gamble because the entry is 16 and the potential gain is 17, 76. Months pass as Emperor Lucan suspiciously refuses to face the Kuzay in battle, despite losing several cities and castles to them. Darius continues to train daily, understanding that all he can do right now is to get stronger for the day when he can do something about it. The whispers among his fellow soldiers about Lucan's incompetence shake him in the beginning, but before long, he finds that he is inclined to agree. <laughs> oh my god, we just intercepted <laughs> a Kuzay caravan. The emperor himself is becoming a caravan bandit. What the fuck? I, dude, I actually want to attack this myself. I'm not going to leave it to the others. I want to see what happens in this fight. All right, come on, cavalry. Leave some pussy for the rest of us, man. Oh shit, they got cavalry too? What the fuck? Yo! Okay, hold up, hold up. Bring up those javelins. Ooh! In the fucking neck! Hey, my fucking kill! Who, who took that? What the fuck, boys? Come on. It's more of a competition to, to get the kill than to actually fight. Ooh, hello. Let's go! Ooh, I just cut off his arm! Let's go! Come here! Come here! Don't fucking run! Come here! Come here, you fucker! Javelin throw, javelin throw, javelin throw. Let's see. Nah, <laughs> too, too fucking far. Yeah, yeah, he went that way, that way, that way, that way. <laughs> go, 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 go! Dude! Why are they feeding them in the Imperial Army? <laughs> Look at Darius! I'm pretty sure it's those push-ups, man. Yeah, they, they pumped up uh, Darius' testosterone levels. Look at that jaw! Dude! Darius grew up to be such a handsome young man. Alright, boys, I'm pretty sure that Emperor Lucan has, is starting to develop dementia or some shit. Instead of fighting on the front lines like everyone else is right now... Oh, they fucking took Umbrella! Lucan, what the fuck are you doing? Instead of fighting on the front lines, he's chasing looters in the middle of the woods. <sighs> Man. Darius is talking mad shit to uh, the people that he's popular with right now in the, in the army. He's talking mad shit, my dude. I'm so sick and tired of this emperor. Instead of being on the front lines, giving Darius the opportunity to stain his blade red with the the blood of the enemies of the empire what the fuck we're not even we're no longer at war with them and we're down to only five cities because they took umbrella i will never forgive you you coward of an emperor how dare he lose precious empire land to these savage horse fuckers i'm gonna go do some push-ups to, to forget about this all right here we go a tournament a tournament, let's put those skills to the test. I've been doing so many push-ups that I could probably solo the entire tournament by just fists alone. Let's see here. Just please, whatever you do, don't put me with Lucan in the same army. I do not want to be with that fucking guy. All right, I'm not with him. Oof, oof. This is my chance to actually prove to, to people, like the people who will see me in this tournament, that I'm more capable of a warrior than that weak-willed Emperor. Hey, and we, we have the the armor that we bought. Ooh, what a shot, I told you, dude. Training Arc Darius is, is on steroids. Training Arc Darius, post-training Arc, is out of this. Oh my god, look at him. Look at him, the perfect soldier, boys, the perfect soldier. Oh, we're gonna fight him. If we go to the next stage, we're gonna fight Emperor Lucan. I better fucking win this. <laughs> Ooh. 
let's go. Backstab his ass. Let's go. I could not have asked for a better teammate. One of my Imperial Veteran Infantry Brothers. People that I stand their ranks with. Not with Emperor Lucon hiding all the way behind and issuing orders. Alright, let me protect my brother. I am your shield. Get him! I got this. Oh, fuck. No way that a coward of an emperor wins against Darius. Darius just keeps moving forward until his enemies are destroyed. <laughs> My brother. Nothing personal, but I need to prove myself. I need to prove that Darius has come a long way from just a simple blacksmith to a trained and lethal warrior. Ladies and gentlemen, behold the champion of the people, Darius. The people of the arena have today witnessed that Darius, a son of the empire, someone who bleeds on the front lines for the empire, has taken down Emperor Lucan in single combat. Well, not even single combat. I, I was 2v1. 2v1 and I took him down. I think that's where uh, this episode is going to end. Darius has really come a long way during this episode. Uh, he's no longer the, the shiny-eyed, naive boy that he was when he first joined this army. He was very impressionable at first with Emperor Lucan, but uh, seeing as Emperor Lucan was not as fierce as Darius wanted him to be with the war against the Kuzey, Darius is starting to have uh, doubts about his leader, and uh, who knows? Who knows what will happen from here and uh, on out? Uh, it's really gonna depend on what uh, Emperor Lucan does in the next war. Until then, Darius is just going to train, become a better soldier slowly but surely, and uh, based on the next war, he'll then decide what to do. But hey, we did come a long way. We did win a tournament against none other than the Emperor himself, and uh, yeah. Darius is becoming one hell of a man, huh? I'm so happy that you guys are enjoying this uh, series. Keep crushing it with the support, the likes, and the comments, and I'll keep bringing you Darius' story. And uh, hey, I'm, I'm probably gonna fast forward the game a little bit until the next war is declared. Next episode is gonna be coming soon, although I need to make a Kenshi video first. So probably anticipate the, the next episode sometime next week. Thank you so much for the support. Hope you enjoyed this video. Love you all, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.